I thought of a fun songwriting exercise. Come play along with me. Okay, so you're gonna draw like a Venn diagram like this with an emotion circle, a description circle, a metaphor circle, and then my songs. I wrote my bad song here. <laughs> I was just listening to a book and it was talking about how a lot of us just wait for motivation to strike to act when actually action is the cause of motivation. Forcing yourself to go through the motions and create is going to motivate you to continue to create. I'm taking off the pressure and I'm trying to write a bad song. So in the emotion box, you're gonna write any words, phrases, or anything that comes to mind around a specific emotion. Get as specific as possible. You could write sad, but that. Write lonely, write things that somebody said to you that made you sad. Write anything that's associated with that emotion. In the description box, pick a place or a scene, a room, in your home and write anything to describe that area or even actions that happened at that location. Now this might arguably be the hardest part but the most fun part. Think of a metaphor that could tie the two together. So for example, if you thought of sad and you thought of the kitchen, maybe your metaphor is about spilled milk. Again, I'm writing a bad song. <laughs> In these overlapping areas, you wanna put phrases or words that have to do with both of these things. So if there's something in your kitchen that keeps making you sad, like let's say you used to have coffee with your boyfriend every morning and now you broke up, maybe you write coffee maker. Same thing here, let's go with the spilled milk example mess, not wanting to clean up. Just write whatever comes to mind. I want you to fill up this chart with as many words or phrases that you can think of. Dialogue stuff going through your head, weird things that remind you of that room or feeling. The more words and phrases, the better because voila, you have a whole word bank to pull from when exploring melodies and spitballing lyrics. Put it to the catchiest chords you can think of and just sing until a melody comes to mind. I think this is gonna make a more interesting song.